Jesse, I vow that by God's grace, I will love you like how Christ loves you. I will lead our marriage selflessly, courageously, and humbly as a servant. I will never cease to pursue you, but I will purpose every day to know you more fully and to love you more truly. And when hard days come and sleepless nights come, I vow to be your fiercest warrior, to summon every ounce of strength given to me, to rise and fight for you and for your heart, to bring you peace and joy beyond measure. And when in my weakness I fall short of Christ's example and fail to love you in the ways I've promised, I vow to be quick to repent, to do whatever I need to do to make myself able to love you better. And Jimmy Woodard, before God, I promise to love you with all my heart, my mind, my soul, my strength. That besides God, there would be no one else that would have the place of adoration and affection that you would hold in my life. I set myself apart solely for you, and I commit my words to you. I commit that my words would be used to build you up. They would be used to bring you life and never to tear you down that they would always be for you and never against you. I commit to be your strong helper, to stand beside you in whatever decision you make, whether I agree or disagree, <laughs> that I would support you and stand with you through dry winters and broken wrists, <laughs> whatever life would bring through happy seasons and sad seasons, through healthy ones and sick ones, and to the best of my ability, I commit to trust you in all things. So I commit my whole heart to you, to seek to know you daily, to know you more fully and fully. And I commit to partner with God, that on a daily basis, I could love you and that he could transform you more and more into his image. That one day that we could stand together and present ourselves before Jesus. So before God, I set myself apart solely for you until death do us part. Yeah. 